two. This is uh, Pierre Fish Aquarium. Um, today I'm doing another update video on my fish room downstairs with um, some of my tanks. Um, as you can see, my tank is always clear, crystal clear of the water. Due to my maintenance on these tanks, um, three water chains a week. Uh, 225 percent water change and 50 percent water change. Um, and I try to uh, actually um, clean my my filter at least every two weeks. And um, I show you actually the filtration I have on these tanks. On the bottom over here, we have the FF the Fugo FX6 uh, API XL. Um, canister filter and on top I have uh, one of those uh, marine lane um, filter of the pads um, so and the same thing over here on this tank I have an API um, canister filter and I have a FX Six on the back before FM6 on the back on this tank um, for the filtration and um, a lot of water change, a lot of water change. Um, since these tanks are kind of stocked with a lot of fish, so so I'm gonna walk back through and show you um, what's new. And um, as you can see, if you follow my my channel, um, pretty much. Y'all pretty know uh, the fish that I have, my Dovi, my Mel Dovi, my the customers, my giant the customers in the back. Female Jaguar. It's my Paku. I have three of them in this tank. And Back there, I have my Mighty Sea Blade and Red Devils. Um, always peeking sometimes each other, nothing very picky. Um, as you can see, that fin is all nice and neat. Um, sometimes they kind of peek in the pop a little bit. But so that's this tank. And over here this is my new addition a breeding pair um i can't quite pronounce this the name of the the secret um but it's my new addition over here my blood pair my male duva that i'm growing out um, um back there is um my pale jack mc a huge male and a female. Um, my female jaguar in this tank. And this young jaguar, I don't know the, the gender yet, if it's a female or a male. My big male jaguar in the back. My female duvai that is growing out. Um, my yellow jacket cichlid. My female trimac in this male. This male is very big. Um, I know it's in the video, but if you can see the fish for yourself, it's massive. Um, and that's a massive pot that you see over there. Um, I was debating on getting a 300 gallon tank, a 265, or a 240 acrylic. Um, so um, I'm trying to make up my mind which one I would get first maybe two or three fish in there so on the bottom um a 75 gallon tank right now it's empty nothing in there uh, uh just to breed some fish in there i'm not sure yet um and over here is another 75 gallon tank with some grown up fish that i have in there um I have three pingashes, catfish. Like I mentioned before, these fish get massive. Um, 
back there is a uh, I think that's a uh, um, yeah those are my two red Texas city that I'm holding now um, and I have a green Texas secret over here that's a green Texas and those two are some red Texas um, that I'm growing out and I have my hybrid the, the three biggest hybrid of Dova and Jaguars I put on um, three on the stake um, trying to grow them out fast um, to see what it looks like pretty much there's one right there as you can see swimming around and my Chevron will catfish in the back oh. <clears throat> Subscribe to my channel, um, leave a comment, and I will be posting a video of uh, the tutorial how to build a stain for your fish tank. Because as you can see, most of the stains over here, I build myself. The other thing that I show you in my back home over here, um, I actually, you actually came like that. I did a few repairs on the tank, but nothing serious. So. Anyway, um, this is Kerry again with Fish Aquarium, and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and stay tuned for more updates on my fish. Thank you.